So the dealership couldn't find out why my satellite radio wasn't working. They had me come pick up my car and they scheduled an appointment for me to come back on another day when they had a loaner car available for me. They said it could take up to a couple days to fix my car. That's why they gave me a loaner, which was nice. We scheduled for me to bring in my car at 8 a.m. and they would have a loaner car ready for me at that time. So far, the customer service gal was doing awesome. But on my arrival, she had to break the news to me that a loaner car wasn't ready. And the reason was, the keys were locked up in the manager's office and the manager was running late. I ended up waiting 45 minutes for my manager and I had to miss an appointment. The good news is I got to sit inside a cold showroom floor staring at cars that my wife won't let me buy. What's interesting to me is that I always get a survey from the manufacturer about the services I have at this dealership. And I have a suspicion based on the way the questions are asked that management's going to have a problem with the customer service department for the way this report comes out. But the reality is, it was the management's fault. So management, before you fly off the handle at a report in a customer service survey, dig into the situation and find out the real cause. Because you might find out it's not your customer service people, it's you.